All right, this week on the Comic Cave, we do versus matches by random draw. Roll the intro. Sammy. Say hi, Sammy. Hi, Sammy. That's Michael on the end over there with his spirit fingers. I'm Bo. <laughs> Sammy is going to tell us by random draw between multiple combo characters we put in the bowl who would win and why. So let's do the random draw, Sammy, if you will. Take two out and read their names. Spawn. Batman Beyond. The Terry McGinnis. I'm going to say Batman Beyond. Why would you think Batman Beyond? I don't know. You know I, mean? I like Batman. All right, Michael, break down Spawn for us. All right, Spawn has a lot of different powers. He has the ability to teleport. He's also a Spawn of Satan, given his name. He has superhuman strength and endurance. But whenever he uses these powers, it drains some of his life force out. Also, he is um, his suits live in parasite, and it, you know gives him extra powers and heals him as well. You know, he also has some magical factors to him as well. Exactly, exactly. Now, it's kind of funny you said his suits living. One could say that Terry McGinnis's bat suit. It's somewhat living because it is art, it's all AI, but it's also helped controlled by Bruce Wayne himself with all the fortune that Bruce Wayne has. So suit armor enhances his strength, the ability to fly, and all kinds of other stuff. And you know what? I'm going to give this one to Terry McGinnis myself. What do you think? I'm going to have to go with Mr. Al Simmons. Spawn. So it's two to one. Oh. We'll let you decide on that one. We'll let you post a comments on that. But we'll uh, go to the next two. And the final two. Alright, draw the last two out and see what you get. Violator. Violator. And the Punisher. Mm. What you got on that? The Punisher. Why would you say the Punisher? Because it sounds like a Jason Statham movie. He is big. He is. I agree with that. He I is like big. Jason. Yeah. He is good. Michael, what you think on that? We got the Violator, or also known as the Clown. Yeah. Well, he's a kind of a short little fat man. Yes. But he has a strength of 15 men. He's also a demon. You know, straight from the pit of hell. So he has that going for him. He has. He can shape shift, size shift, regenerate, telepathy, and he can also possess others to do their bidding for him. This is but, true. Yeah. This is all true. Now the Punisher, on the other hand, it depends on what storyline you want to go from, either Marine, cop, but still feels no remorse and believes he's doing justice and is an expert with any kind of mm -hmm. guns, knives, any weapons of, of any kind. And the last time I remember check, you know, the uh, Ghost Rider did the penistare on him and Ghost Rider's a spawn of Satan also, yeah. and it didn't work because he believes in what he's doing. You know, I'm going to go with this. I think the Punisher is a legit person to take out the Violator. I don't think it's no quit attitude, and it, he will do what it takes to win. I agree with you on that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. We, as a, we all three agree with that. Yeah. Maybe Jason Statham can do the movie. I Who knows? So. Hey. That would actually be good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Make it happen, MCU. You own it. Anyway, as always, uh, I'm Bo. That's Michael. This is Sammy. Say hi, Sammy. Hi. Say bye, Hi. Sammy. Bye. All right. If you uh, like this video, please uh, like, share, subscribe, post comments down below. And as always, this is the Comic Cave.
Roll the outro. So we're going to do random draw. So we asked Sammy on here to do a random draw of a few select characters we placed in a bowl. She has no idea who or what or anything, but she's going to tell us who would win and why. Let's get the incredible